Hello guys and girls, in today's guide we'll be setting up a sorter and bus to produce biomass or even biofuel if you've unlocked it for easy early game biomass generators. Now generally I'd recommend rushing coal but if not this is the next best thing. So first off as always we need to plan out the system, first by placing foundations and then putting a container at the end point which is where you want to collect said biomass or biofuel in order to feed the generators. Now from here our generators will be placed either side although for particularly large generator setups or chains it may be ideal to split the final row of conveyors so they enter containers equal distances apart. As you can see here we have four generators equally spaced between two containers. Now it's super important to merge all of the biofuel or biomass conveyors together before splitting them into the said containers because if it's not first merged you may find a lot of the biofuel is distributed to one side of the containers such as the one closest to the side of the wood or the leaf constructors. Now moving on it is important that this section is easy to access so bear that in mind where you're placing these. Now our next option is to think about all the ways in which we can make biomass. So for example we can create biomass using leaves, carapace, organs, wood, mycelia and therefore we need at least four different constructors, in fact five ideally, to cover each item. Now if you're collecting a lot of wood and leaves it could actually be ideal to add a couple more constructors to save bottlenecking, that way you have two different constructor lines for those particular items. So for this video we're going to place seven constructors, two for leaves, two for wood and one for both the carapaces, the organs which may well not be in use for biomass in the future update as well as mycelia. Now these need to be placed with enough room to add biofuel constructors afterwards, that way we can filter them down the line Therefore the end product will be merged together before filtering off into the end containers through splitting. Now speaking of which, if you're splitting to more than four containers then I do highly recommend checking out my advanced splitter guide and this will just save you a lot of time working out the splits as it can get quite complicated. Now all that's left to do is place a container next to your entrance or by the generators for you to deposit the said leaves and wood. From there we'll be connecting it to smart splitters which will separate each item into its said compartments. Now this does use smart splitters so it's not the best early game option but certainly if you're getting to the late game this is definitely a good option for creating a biofuel generator system um, if you have decided to shun coal for whatever reason. Now the only thing left to do at this point would be to actually save yourself some hassle late game by housing the factory as we will see a notable change in frames per second and optimization when the new experimental build goes to early access. Anyway guys that's all we have time for in this video, if you did find it helpful please do smash that like button as it helps me exponentially. Also if you want to see more and haven't already do make sure you subscribe and if you want to be more involved with our community do check out our discord in the link below. Anyway guys until next time, thanks for watching, ciao for now.